Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. This is Cinefied. Today we're playing a game called Unreal Life. It's about a girl that has lost her memories and she's aided by a talking traffic light to find her memories. Sorry for my weird audio because I am recording this while having a little bit of a cold. Just a sniffly nose, hence um, whatever my weird voiceover is. Anyways, let's start this game. So far, I'm really liking the music for this game. It's so peaceful. You're going to love tomorrow's story. Okay then. See you tomorrow. Unreal life. Emergency! Oh my gosh, there's so much Japanese writing in here. Checking field intensity. Starting life form communication. Starting guidance system. Success. Starting conversation process. Requesting reply. Are you alright? I am the high performance AI traffic light 195. I am communicating with you directly through your brain. What is your name? Can you remember it? I'm being spoken to by a traffic light? How? You do not seem to have sustained any physical injury. It is Unit 195's duty to guide the user to a parent or guardian. Please tell me your address or contact information. I can't remember anything. Not even that you lost consciousness while walking along this street? Do not worry. 195 offers comprehensive support to its user. I have checked my logs to show you the direction you have come from. Please proceed in this direction. Move left, move right. Ah, S sorry, I had put up the guidelines backwards. Are you serious? You're a traffic light. Which way should I go? I have fixed the program. No mistakes this time. Please follow these guidelines. Well, that's a little suspicious of a traffic light. Talk, what should I do? Talk. I am the wireless traffic light 195. I will do my best to offer you comprehensive guidance and support until you are brought to safety. The traffic light is speaking. Is that a problem? It's not a problem, but it's a little unorthodox. Which, this way, right? Examine. I can't read it. What? Examine. A utility pole. A tree. I don't know what kind. Wait, are those shoes? Is there someone behind this fence? Huh? There's something here. Out of all the stories you told me, my favorite is the one about the girl with the blue shoes. Really? That's also my favorite one. Why, that's... Sometimes I find myself thinking, wouldn't it be wonderful if we could escape this world? Escape this world? No. My head. It hurts so much. Emergency. Analyzing brainwaves. Found visual fragment. Canceling noise. Completed. System. Analysis complete. Sending analysis results to brain. Users' brainwaves were irregular, which made the analysis take longer. I found a visual fragment during the analysis. I can see the, the place where I am. It looks like it, but it's a bit different. I believe you are seeing the past. There's someone there. Miss Sakura! Do you know her? I'm struggling to understand the reason for this vision. Why are there just random shoes there, though? Like, it's a memory. Huh. Weird. Miss Sakura, where is she? Please calm down. Who is this Miss Sakura person to you? A teacher. That's all I know. But I have to find her. I must find her. But 195's duty is to guide you to a parent or guardian. I cannot guide you to Miss Sakura. I won't be able to see Miss Sakura? Then I'll just search for her myself. That would be too dangerous. An order to protect you. But you can't find her, can you? I 
I can. Unit you know, 195 is equipped with high performance AI. Really? Really? I will guide you smoothly to Miss Sakura. So, what should I do? Well, first of all, I must gather more information on how you are able to float a visual fragment by touching these blue shoes. When you touch them, your brain registered an abnormal amount of activity. The key to this phenomenon might be touching things. For example, try touching that utility pole and see if anything happens. Saw a memory from blue shoes. Touch. Maybe if you touch that utility pole, something could happen. Okay. What's this? You are there, and there is a crow. I have formulated a hypothesis. I believe this is a form of extrasensory perception. Extra what? It means that you are able to read the memories of the objects you touch. It is difficult to believe, even for me. And if this pole's memory is correct... The crow took my key? Indeed it did. The crow could still be within reach. Let us get that key back. But I have no idea what direction it went. Not the case. The memories of things, in other words, are things that happened in the past. This would mean that you are able to see things that have happened previously. Do you understand? I guess so. If you touch an object which holds memories of the crow, you might be able to tell where the crow went. Try touching the objects in this vicinity. It seems Miss Sakura was here. Where did she go? Why are you looking for your teacher? Touch. Oh, a crow! Now you are seeing the memories of this tree. There is a crow, but that is not enough to tell you which direction it went. You should look for a different memory. the touch. I can't see anything. It seems you cannot read the memories of this utility pole. I suppose that you can only read the memories of specific objects. Nothing happens when I touch this. Okay. Only specific items. Touch. This is a memory from me, Unit 195. You are lying down unconscious. That must be the most recent thing to have caught my attention. Ah! And there was a crow! S sorry A crow is going in this direction. I managed to read your brainwaves while you were looking at objects' memories. From now on, I will make it so the option to touch objects only appears when you can read their memories. It seems that a crow went in that direction. We should follow it. Please, please wait. I will display some guidelines. Uh. Guidelines displayed! You know, you don't need to show me those every time. Then, I will only show them during emergencies. Saw a memory from 195. Oh! What's wrong? Nothing. It seems that the crow has come in to this direction. Have you checked your bag? There may be a key inside. I'll check my bag then. R1 It was in my It was in my bag from the start There's something written on it Take out What is this? It's a blue book It was already in my bag when I woke up Book? What would that be? What? You don't know? I do not I only possess so much knowledge as I need to guide users It's like a bunch of pages held together with letters on them. I see. A kind of recording medium used by humans. And what is written on it? Huh. I... I can't read. I see. Some of your brain functions seem to be disabled. For now, you probably cannot read. This book may eventually provide you with valuable hints as to your identity. But for the time being, you should focus on retrieving the key. Right. There is something shiny. It's too... it's too far. 
Hmm, maybe if you shook the fence it would fall down. Oh, oops, no! Let me shake the fence. Pew, 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 pew. Yeah! Obtained red marble. This is a red marble. It's a shiny round toy made out of glass. I see, it could come in candy. We should probably keep it. Oh, and if you take an item out of your bag, you will be able to use it on the things and people around you. Some items may help you just by taking them out of the bag. I suggest you try to take the marble out. Take it out. I believe that you cannot use the marble right now. However, it could be useful later on. Should such a chance present itself, take the marble out of the bag, examine a person or object, and select use marble. Oh, it's the crow! Let me examine this door first. It's locked. Someone probably lives there. Oh. Okay. Go up. Crow, don't you dare fly away from me. Talk. Ka! Ka ka ka! Is it angry? The crow is saying something. I will start the translation program. You speak crow? Connecting audio stream. Language code patterns. <laughs> Converse with animal. You. Who? Shiny things. Love. This man. No touch. Go away. Uh. It looks bent on keeping that key. Can we do nothing about it? I believe it. Let me use the marble on the crow. Use red marble. Yo, shiny thing. What? That mine. Give back. Want that. Not want this never more. Use red marble. This is such a weird crow. Are you like a magpie? Or yes, we have retrieved the key. But what lock does it open? Your ability to read the memories of objects could help us find out where to use the key. Put key inside the bag. Let's talk to the crow. Look, shiny, happy. Oh, okay. I'm glad you're happy. Uh, key. Take out. I wonder what door this key opens. It could be somewhere around here. Oh, touch. There's someone on the lower floor. Miss Sakura. I will try this door then. Touch. This door doesn't show anything. Oh, that's weird. I'm still gonna use my key on it. Use key. Use the key. Man, why is it red? Oh, it opened. The door opened. You seem excited. Oh, apologies, I let myself go. You see, traffic lights cannot normally open doors. I will concentrate on guiding you, user. 195? What is the matter? Just call me Hal. Yes, Hal. Let us proceed now. <laughs>